Hey everyone, it's uh, Honda Nguyen. How's everybody on doing today? Hoping everybody is having a great day today. Alright guys, uh, in this video I'm going to show you guys how to create a brand new email from Gmail. Okay, because I got a lot of friends and family um, wondering uh, how do they create an email from Gmail because they are brand new and uh, they don't know how to make one. So uh, instead of uh, telling each person how to do it, I'm going to make a video so that way you guys can all watch and um, just do it yourself, okay? Before we get into uh, the video here, if you guys haven't subscribed to my channel yet, make sure to uh, hit that subscribe button, okay? And next to that uh, red subscribe button, make sure to tap on the notification bell so whenever I upload any new videos, you'll be the first to be notified. All right, guys, with that being said, uh, let's go ahead and get started. All right, so what you want to do is you guys want to open up a browser, okay, internet browser, as you guys can see, just follow, um, in this video, just follow my mouse, okay, it's moving right now. And once you open up the browser, you want to go ahead and type in gmail.com, okay. And then it's going to open up this page right here where it's going to ask you to log in but uh, you don't have an email yet so how are you going to log in right so what we're going to do is we're going to go down here just follow my mouse it says create account okay so um, we are going to create an account so go ahead and click on that and once you click on it it's going to ask for myself or to manage my business just go ahead and put uh, for myself and then uh, once you click on for myself it's going to lead you to the next screen here and it's going to say create your google account to continue to gmail okay so what i'm going to do is i'm just going to do a generic one just for uh, testing you know just for this video okay just for this purpose here so i'm just going to make up whatever here um i'm just going to do testing testing so just put your real name all right guys but in this video, like I said, I'm just making up anything, okay? And then when you go to username, just create. Try to get one where nobody has it. But if someone has it, it's going to tell you. So no worries. So what I'm going to do is testing uh, email 2020. Let's see what happens. Testing email 2020 at gmail.com. If it goes through, that's going to be your email, okay, guys? And then on the bottom here is going to make you create a password. It says use eight or more characters with a mix of letters, numbers, and symbols. Okay, so do something that you're going to for, you're going to remember. All right, and then right here you can actually type tap this so you can see what you're typing. Okay, so let me go ahead and tap it so you can see what I'm typing. I'm going to put my password as also testing one two three four and see if that works. All right, so once you get that uh, password, uh, once you create your password, click next. And then the next one, if the email has already been taken, it's going to tell you right here that username is taken. Try another. Okay, so this is good that it's popping up. So at least you guys know that uh, there's times where it's going to be taken already. So you just got to make up a new one. And then down here it says choose a stronger password okay so try a mix of letters numbers and symbols so I guess mine was pretty easy so um, they didn't allow that but anyway let's change the uh, the uh, email real quick I'm just gonna put I am testing email 2020 okay I am testing email 2020 and then what we're gonna do is um, we're gonna go ahead and do uh, email 2020 and let's see if that's going to work for the password 2020 and then we're going to go ahead and press next and that one actually works guys okay so once you uh, are able to go past that other screen it's going to lead you to this one right here where it's going to ask you sometime it may ask you for your phone number and sometimes it may not you just get lucky sometimes okay whereas this one right here it says optional so I'm not gonna put it in okay 
and then also down here you can put another email like let's say if you have a Yahoo email or a Hotmail uh, you can put it here just in case if later on you forget your password or whatnot on this new email that uh, you just created okay and then down here they want you to put your birthday so what I'm gonna do is what is today March 27th and then I'm gonna just gonna put year 2000 okay and gender is male and it asks why we ask for this information you can click on that if you want I'm not I'm just gonna go to next and then um, it's gonna make you agree to the privacy and terms all right go ahead and just go ahead and just press agree just let it do its thing here it's loading right now so once everything is good to go you're gonna actually go into a uh, next page here where it says welcome down here it says email by Google simple smart and secure okay so this is telling us that we successfully made the email okay guys so like I was saying earlier if you when you guys were starting you know when we were starting to create the email it's gonna block us if we chose the same one someone already had or have then we have to create another one okay or if the password is not good they're gonna stop us there as well to uh, make a better password but anyways ours was good so that uh, lead us to this successful screen here I'm gonna go ahead and press next and then it's gonna say choose a view default comfortable compact I'm just gonna put default put OK and then once you are in uh, this is how the Gmail looks like and you are successfully done and you just created a brand new email from Gmail alright guys so that is exactly how you create an email uh, from Gmail step by step okay uh, it was actually pretty easy all right okay so once you created the email and you want to test it let's um, click here on the T and then just let's go ahead and sign out and just remember your um, your uh, what's that called your email okay so our email for this purpose here is I am testing email 2020 at gmail.com okay so let's go ahead and sign out and then once you sign out sometimes it still has it right there go ahead and just click on that if it doesn't then you can you can just type it in or use another account we're gonna go ahead and just put click on this one because that's our email that we just uh, created and then the password was email 2020 so let's do that you can click on this I thing again here so that way you can see it so email 2020 that was our password and then we're gonna go ahead and click on next let's say if you forget your password you can also put forgot password uh, but uh, hopefully you guys don't forget it because you guys just created it right so hopefully you don't uh, but if you did forget it go ahead and click on that all right okay so go ahead and press next or click on next and if the e and if the password is correct it's gonna go into the your uh, email okay it also says right here protect your account if you want to update your uh, recovery phone number or recovery email go ahead and press update but I'm not going to do that. I'm just going to get, go ahead and press confirm. And then once you press confirm, it goes back into your email. Okay, so um, that is letting us know that uh, we successfully created a brand new email from Gmail and we signed out. And then we also successfully signed back into our email again uh, because, you know, we know our password and username, which is the your email itself. Okay. If you forget your email, you don't know what it is, you can click on this this icon up here, or you can put a sometimes you can put your picture right there as well. But for this uh, right now it just says a T, okay? And this is where you can locate your email as well. You guys see that? It says I am testing email 2020 at gmail.com. Alright guys, so uh, that is about it. If you guys have any questions or comment, leave them down below. 
All right, if you guys haven't subscribed to my channel yet, make sure to subscribe because I don't want you guys to miss out the next video, okay? Uh, just want to say thank you very much for uh, watching this video today, and I hope this uh, tutorial uh, helped you guys out, all right? So with that being said, uh, yeah, thanks a lot, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Take care, guys. Bye-bye.